Hello friends. My name is Cypher. And today I am really excited cause new teaser for the next operation has been released. It's known as Operation Grim Sky. And two new operators also have been teased which is currently you are watching on a screen right now. One on the left side is an American attacker with some kind of blow torch gadget. I am assuming that you cannot counter him with bandit or mute. So I think you can use him to make a small hole in the wall which you can create faster and sneak onto the objective room. But if you want to make a big hole in a reinforced wall it will take a time and even in that process there are chances enemy come by surprise and kill you. So I might be thinking if this is the situation then Habana or Thermite is the better option over him. But one use of this operator is that you don't need Thatcher or Twitch in your team. Now moved on to another operator on the left side of the screen. She is a defender with some kind of shield. Ubisoft stated that she's from Great Britain. She's a tough police officer who's an expert on mob behavior and snatch squad tactics. She knows she belongs on the front line and she won't tolerate any nonsense. I think if Thermite or Habana open reinforced wall and plant a diffuser then she might help to defuse a bomb with her shield or she might block attacker to entering from that hole. I had one question in mind if you have to go all the way to the hole near reinforced wall and you have to put shield manually then there are a lot of chances to get killed in that process. Ubisoft also teased with Hereford base rework if, then Ubisoft posted a video that you are currently watching on the screen. Ubisoft said that we're also introducing our first map rework Hereford base. Despite the high chance of rain at this iconic training facility, we're renovating the place and making many adjustments to raise the bar for competitive play. There are a lot of changes has been made to this map and I just wish it's balanced for both sides before it's come to the ranked. Ubisoft also fixing weapon misalignment issue. Ubisoft said, we're bringing forth much anticipated modifications to address the weapon sites misalignment. It was a really big issue for a long time. Ubisoft also said that they are fixing operator idle pick that means if you are AFK during operator pick phase then I guess it will give you an idle choice rather than giving a recruit and this all first available on the technical test servers. In the end, just a reminder that Rainbow Six Siege Free Weekend is coming on August 17th to 19. If you haven't tried this game yet I highly recommend you to try it out on this free weekend. If you like this video then please like, comment, share and if you are new to my channel then subscribe if you like it. Till then goodbye my friends.